Top story this morning, really a, a sad story. Final farewell today for West Warwick's Matt Dennison, 17 year old died on March 10th from injuries sustained in an automobile crash last month. His funeral mass is scheduled to begin at 11 o'clock this morning and 12 news reporter Kate Walsh is live in our studi studio now with more now he'll be remembered today. Well, if Matthew Dennison's wake Thursday afternoon was any indication of how his funeral will be held today, it will be busy with people wanting to pay their respects and to honor him. You can see a long line of family, friends and members of the hockey community gathering to say goodbye yesterday at the wake. His funeral will be held at 11 this morning at St. Gregory the Great Church in Warwick. West Warwick High School is also live streaming the funeral at the Field House for the large hockey community who knew and loved Matt and have continued to find ways to support his family this past month. They're also planning a stick salute for the funeral procession as it passes by the Field House and the ice rink. And tonight, the Rhode Island Hockey Coaches Association All-Star Games will play in Matt's honor at Schneider Arena. Proceeds from the games will benefit the Denison family. Now, Dennison was the captain of the West Warwick Exeter West Greenwich High School hockey team. He and his friend Kevin McDonald were in a car that was hit by an alleged drunk driver last month as they were headed to the rink. His family has asked in lieu of flowers, people donate to Mothers Against Drunk Driving. And you'll hear from his friend Kevin McDonald in the next half hour. Live in the studio, I'm Kate Walsh, 12 News. More local news now. West Warwick senior and hockey captain Matt Dennison will be laid to rest this morning, but his legacy will live on and be honored beyond his funeral this morning. 12 News reporter Kate Walsh joins us live with how the 17 year old will be honored. Matt Dennison's funeral mass will be held at 11 o'clock this morning at St. Gregory the Great Church in Warwick, but it will also be live streamed for people gathering here at the Thomas Lamb Memorial Field House, where members of the hockey community are expected to gather for a stick salute as the funeral procession makes its way past there and the rink. And this is video from his wake Thursday afternoon. You can see family, friends, members of the hockey community, some in jerseys gathering to say goodbye. Matt was the captain of the West Warwick Exeter West Greenwich High School hockey team. He and his friend Kevin McDonald were in a car hit by an alleged drunk driver on February 12th as they were headed to the ice rink. Kevin sustained injuries. Matt was in the hospital for weeks but died from his injuries on March 10th. Kevin spoke to 12 News earlier this week about Matt and his own recovery. I'm going to go back and play hockey and just be better for him as well because uh, I know he'd want me to. I know he'd want everybody to be better than they, than they were before. And tonight, the Rhode Island Hockey Coaches Association All-Star Games will be played in honor of Matt. All proceeds from tickets will go to the Denison family. Live in the studio, I'm Kate Walsh, 12 News.